this, you can help plan the future of neighborhoods here in Indianapolis. 24 Hour News 8's Elizabeth Choi joining us now live from the Hawthorne Community Center. And Elizabeth, I understand there is a community meeting taking place there right now. Well, it actually gets underway in about 30 minutes at 5:30, Phil. Uh, but soon, yes, and they have maps set up. They're asking the community for their input. So you can see this map here. This is a working draft of how they want Indianapolis to look in the future. But what they're asking the community is for their input. What are they doing right here? What are they doing wrong? They want suggestions. The goal is to attract people to the city to make Indianapolis their home as well as retain current residents. The meetings will focus on planning for what they call 21st century amenities and lifestyles. In particular, leaders would like to see changes in tran transit corridors and cultural districts and how to use the land for transportation, economic development and parks and recreation, for example. Officials are calling it the Marion County Land Use Plan and it's part of the broader 2020 initiative. Through Plan 2020, we're really taking a ground up look at our core plans to make sure that we're better positioned for the future. And as part of that, we've developed a new system that really creates a more flexible, um, kind of adaptive recommendation, set of recommendations. The Department of Metropolitan Development organized the event. Public input will be used in the land use plan. Now that plan will be presented in October for final review. You can also give your input online, make comments online, and we'll tell you exactly how to do that if you visit our website, which is wishtv.com. Again, the meeting is underway at 530, but there will be 12 more meetings in the future. Live from the city's west side, Elizabeth Choi, 24-hour News 8.